So uh, if you're working with uh, Xcode and you want to make uh, some for iOS uh, and you want to use the tab view, it's pretty simple. So they start you off with a project that you can uh, start off with where it gives you a tab view controller and two views. Uh, however, it doesn't really tell you very much on how you may want to create more than one view. So I'm going to show you a simple video on how to do that. So let's just get rid of this other view here so we can see a lot more. And all you need to do is look for a view controller. And right now it's right here at the top, but you can type down here and get that too. So all we have to do is drag the view controller onto the stage here. And so this is if we want a third view. And let's actually add two of them. So there's four. So you can see that you can put as many as you like in there. And what we're looking for is called the tab bar item, which is right here. So what you got to do is you got to kind of select this. And once you see how it's highlighted, drag it right on there. Do the same thing for this one. And drag it on there. And you can see you have new items. Let's uh, zoom out a bit. So uh, they do now have t um, tab bar and now you just have to take the tab bar controller which is right here and control click and drag and what you're looking for is a thing called view controller and boom there you go do it for this one here too and boom and as you can see here in our tab controller and let's zoom up to 100% here you can see all the items and let's just uh, label these ones here three and we can label this one four um, and to see the different uh, views we could just give them different colors so we could put a custom color in here let's say we'll put this blue color in for this one and Let's go over to this one here. Let's put a custom color in the background here. Let's go with this red color. And here we can just do this for all our views. Even though this one, these two have text in it, but we could just, here, give them these goofball colors. Here we can just get rid of these things here. And I think we already had a blue one. Oh, we can do, wait, what's this color? Okay, so you can see the different colors. So just remember, this green color is first, second, third, and fourth. And I already had the thing running here. And all we have to do is build it now, and uh, it should just automatically work. And here's my thing down here, and here's our first tab, our second tab, third tab, and fourth tab. So it works that easily. And let's go back into here for a second. Um, there is um, code for the verse first view controller dot swift second view controller dot swift well you can do this uh, for your two new view controllers just by going to file and oops we don't want to add files what we want to do is create a new file so new and you can select the coco class UI view controller and you give it the name that you want to call it and boom it will create you you know for this example here I'll just put anything in there it doesn't really matter to me um, and you can see it creates another Swift file now you have to set it up so it looks just like this one which is not too hard but that's how simple it is to bring in your new files and start programming for using tabs and let's just zoom out for a second Ooh, that might be too much and that's pretty simple um, it's a lot more simpler than using Zojo or other tools that don't even have tab bar support built in okay so thanks for joining me and have fun